What's up gamers? This is Proto and welcome to Average Plays. Today we are starting a series up of Project Wingman. Now this is a very fun and interesting indie game that we had that came out towards the end of the year. A very fun and exciting game. If you're a fan of Ace Combat 7, dog fighting games, arcade games, sim like games using aircraft, then I highly recommend you checking this game out. This is made by an indie team and they did an excellent job. If you guys want to take a look at the review, I did a review of it. You guys can take a look at the view right here. Otherwise, let's not waste any more time. We're going to hop into this let's play of this series. All right, then we'll get the campaign started up. Now, if you want to get a real challenge in this game, you can start from easy all the way to mercenary. And trust me, as you get up in the higher levels, they do make it more difficult. And I like how they add little game modifiers in it so you can change it up, make the game a little bit more interesting to your playthroughs. Uh, but we're going to do a normal, keep our gameplay for our let's play. Simple and fun. Will be fun and challenging. So the first mission is going to be Black Flag. Now there's going to be some tests that's going to play through here and I'm going to speak it out because you're not going to see part because of me in the way. So generations go, a global catalyst event scorched the whole world. Nearly exposed and volatile material combined with an earth shatter to tonic collapse, dismantling civilization whole. That's messed up. The world order was destroyed. History as we know it changed forever. But from the ashes, a new era began. Hundreds of years have passed. Wow. Humanity is now in the time known as After Calamity. So the event was called a calamity, and now we're in the After Calamity. So AC 432, January 9th. Mercenary Series of Carl Corporation, Hitman Team. Squadron 1, our attack name is Monarch. So that's who we're playing as, is Monarch. Our contract with this backwater place is just about to come to an end. And, well, thank God. I don't mind a tropical vacation every once in a while, but it's not very glamorous, considering we're here to work. Anyway, one last thing before the defense minister releases our contract, and we move on to bigger and better. Hitman team, you haven't gotten all that much airtime this deployment, so you're taking point with this operation. We have confirmed the location of the Burlock Privateer headquarters off the coast on the southwestern edge of the Jesta Island chain. They're a mercenary group like us who unfortunately have turned to outright piracy. According to surveillance data, we have determined that they are the culprit of the recent high-profile hijacking of the Federation-registered cargo ship Mei Lynx. The Mei Lynx is supposedly carrying volatile cargo belonging to the Federation's Department of Global Energy and Sustainability Office. Nothing specific from the Federation contact about the cargo. However, our orders are to retrieve it if possible, or to neutralize it if we can't. Attempts to negotiate for it have turned up with nothing, so we're going in. Hitman team, you are to approach the island from the south along with support and establish control over the area. Your objective is to eliminate any surrounding anti-air and resistance on the island. After that, secure an LZ for our operator group Ronin to ascertain the cargo. Once Ronin lands, maintain air superiority until the next stage of the operation is determined. Be aware that the Burlocks have other Merc pilots on tap, so enemy reinforcements could be a factor. Normally, we'd stay out of contact with any Federation-adjacent taskings. But this is the last thing we need to do for our current contract, so I'll let it slide. Two birds with one stone. Easy enough, right? Now get to work. Dismissed. Gotcha, boss. Like so we got hostile air targets and hostile ground. We have more ground than air, so I'll keep that in mind for my loadout. So now we'll get into starting the mission. And I'm going to play through this. Let's play through some of the initial aircraft and then change them out as I go through. 
So the first aircraft we got originally was these two, the T-21, the trainer, which only has anti-ground weapons, and this one. It was a trainer also, but no biggie. We'll run through it with this one. So all we got are ground bombs for it. All right, so let's go. Oh, wait. wrong button. Launch. Subject Hitman Monarch. Aircraft weapon system, which is the weapon key. Gotcha. Crank this baby up and see what we can do. There's another plane right over there. Let's grab this boat first. Hey, your ship is sunk. This one is closer. Good hit. Alright. So our aircraft is closer on this one. So let's go after it. They got their back to us. Not good for them. Good hit. Got a congestion up here. Let's see if we can hit this one with the bomb. Good hit. You gotta be careful because your plane is still moving while you're dropping bombs. And it's just right. Monarch ordinance away. Gonna hit him. Splash. Missed. I was about to fly upside down. Alright. Let's try for a ground target. Those don't really go nowhere too much. Oh! Taking some damage. Bombs away! Good hit. Present to you. Let's take care of these speedboats. Haha, <laughs> can't hear me. Didn't even see that one. Whoa! I was gonna 
Okay, so now. Bombs away! Ah, oh, they took my shot. No biggie. Let's go ahead and finish off these last two. See if we can get it before it takes off. Do a hard turn. It'll take off for you. Now let's deal with our upcoming guests. Get a lot. Surprise will on me. Gun, gun, guns. Good hit. Last one. Good hit. One bomb left. Let's see if we can hit it on the main target. Alright, last bomb. Let's see if we can hit our target with. Oh, that was a good hit. I think that was a good job. That's why they wanted to clean the scene. Think the water's still alright? We still got sunshine by the time we RTB. Just draw out and become a surfer or something you bomb. Oh yeah, me, you, and Flight Lord here just running around a beach ball on a gentrified resort built from our blood money. <laughs> Sound good, Mark? With that thought, we've got inbound from due north. Same thing uh. as before. Fighters approaching the flight to your direct south. Flash item, but we will flag it with hostiles. Easy, easy. Flashing IFF. We're just the help. And by the looks of it, went to the bow of Posse. You heard by those works in the fort, buddy? The boss tents now, I guess. We got no beer here. It's your business. I'm sure you guys understand. Put me on, Galaxy. This is Assassin One, call sign Kaiser. I'm the leader of the Sicario Mercenary Corps. We do understand your situation. 
Money came through from this contract, and our opportunities in this region have just about dried up. If no one objects, and your contract with Zakario is still in effect, pack your bags. I looked a little into the Cascadian situation, and I believe we'll make a little something of ourselves there. So I like gonna make some money. So that's gonna be the end of the first mission. Hope you guys enjoy this playthrough. Kinda starts off a little bit slow. But I can tell you the next mission and definitely the missions after that, they get way more interesting. So I will catch you guys for the next episode in this Let's Play of Project Wingman. What's up, guys? I hope you guys enjoyed that video. If you definitely like it, make sure to hit that like button. Let me know you guys enjoy the content like this. I'll work on doing some other videos for you guys. If you haven't already subscribed make sure you hit that subscribe button we do a lot on this channel we do reviews on some of the latest games that come out we do top 10 new games coming out every month we do less plays like this and so much more so make sure you hit that subscribe button so you can see it when it drops if you guys want to reach out to me you can hit me up on twitter drop me a dm on there you can join our facebook page follow us on instagram and keep you up to date on what we're doing don't be surprised if you hit me up i might talk you to death because i love talking about gaming and make sure to take a look at our Twitch channel. I stream every Monday, Wednesday, and Saturday playing a variety of different games. So depending on what you like, depending on you might want to see something new. Do you want to just sit up and just watch me play games or chat it up with me? I just love playing games. But this is Proto, and I'll catch you guys in the next video.